student athletes at Tennessee State University. Mr. Lewis Leeper, who is a senior student at Tennessee State University, and Ms. Crystal Davis, also a senior student from Tennessee State University. And both are from the state of Tennessee, are, are you not? Yes. Very good. Welcome, both of you, to Black Pulse. Mr. Leeper, just a while ago, uh, both Coach Thomas and others have said something in terms of your academic accomplishments uh, as well as your athletic ability. And I'd like to talk about uh, your academic accomplishments today uh, rather than your uh, athletic accomplishments because I think that there's a real problem in terms of uh, whether or not people believe that uh, students, uh, many athletes, are really competent uh, scholars. And, I, and, and I'd like for you to say something about your academic experiences at Tennessee State University. Um, I came to Tennessee State in 1982, and my goal was to um, become the best football player I could become and to graduate with uh, distinction. And graduation is Saturday, and um, we've had excellent success uh, in our football season, and we also and I will graduate with distinction. And the coaches have always stressed the importance of going to school and doing your best because football was just a, a means to get into it. was just a means to um, pay for your education. So, very well, uh, Mr. Davis, uh, you're involved with the basketball program as well as the uh, softball program. Uh, what about you and uh, your career at Tennessee State University? Well, it's been a good career, and I enjoyed playing basketball and softball. Well. I had a lot of injuries uh, leading up to my senior year, but it was an experience. What are you planning on doing uh, after you complete your education at Tennessee State University? Well, I'm a speech pathology and audiology major at Tennessee State University, and I'm getting a teacher certificate, and hopefully in May of next year I'll be graduating and starting my teaching. Are you going to become involved in uh, female athletics on the uh, college or high school level? Yeah, this. well, next year, um, hopefully I help the upcoming coach, be, you know, help him out, student assistant. So you will uh, be at Tennessee State University as a coach uh, yes, next year? student assistant, hopefully, yes. What about you, Mr. Leeper? What are some of your uh, uh, accomplishments and what are some of the things that you're looking forward to after you graduate? Um, I'm planning on attending um, Meharry Medical College, and I would like to become a surgeon or either do research. Now I understand you're also involved in some aspect of uh, that program at this moment, are you not? Yes, I work in Dr. James Adams' lab right now and we do research. Our, our lab is a toxicology lab and he sh he's showing me many aspects of research and this should help me later on in my career. Well, now, have you already made uh, ad, uh, advancements toward going to, to uh, Meharry? Uh, what, what's the situation? Okay, I have it. My interview is June the 5th, and um, I'm still waiting for official acceptance, but I do have an interview, so I'm waiting to hear from there. Very good. Uh, recently, Ms. Davis, you were also honored uh, as the most valuable player at mm -hmm. the uh, softball, uh, on the softball team at the uh, All Sports Banquet at Tennessee State University. Perhaps you'd like to say something about that. Well, I'm glad they thought I was the most valuable player. I couldn't hit that well, but my defense and everything else was intact. And I sort of stayed in the coach's ear all the time, you know, helping them out and, you know, trying to keep the girls together because we weren't a good team, but we weren't bad. But, you know, we could play with the best. Well, now, what kind of record did you have overall, and exactly where does the uh, soft female softball team fit within the over framework of uh, female athletics at Tennessee State University? Well, it's, it's kind of in the backdrop, but if, if we have a, you know, continue to have a sports softball for a sport, it, it'll soon come out to be one of the best, because we have some good athletes on the team. Most of them were basketball players or volleyball players, but all around they were good athletes. Very well. Mr. Leeper, what would you say to uh, students who might be finishing high school at this point and perhaps considering an institution of higher education? Uh, what would you say in terms of encouraging them to come to Tennessee State University? I think Tennessee State would be an excellent, cho a excellent choice because it's, we have an excellent, excellent football program. We have the Tiger Bells, which 
are world known. And also, we have an excellent academic program because the teachers, they really care. They'll help you in, in any way they can. Like Dr. Adam, Adams, he's uh, taking me in his lab and he shows me practical things that I can do. So overall, Tennessee State would be an excellent choice. Very well. And uh, Ms. Davis, uh, in terms of uh, encouraging students, what would you say to those students? I would say first, get your lesson coming out of high school so you won't have any trouble getting into college. And if you want to be an athlete and a student, continue to get your lesson and everything else will fall in place. Mr. Leeper, do you have any uh, parting words that you'd like to say uh, over the last minute that we have? Well, just you should seriously consider coming to Tennessee State because, like I said, the academic program is excellent and the teachers will help you and you can graduate. Very well, and Ms. Davis? Yes, I'll just like to uh, thank all my teachers and everybody that helped me come to school from high school on up and thank Coach Thomas for his con contributions during this year because without him I, it'll be, it would have been hard. Very well, let me thank the two of you for helping us to uh, wind down this program and not only the two of you but also Coach Temple and Coach Thomas for coming by and talking about the athletic program at Tennessee State University today. And this is Dr. James Haney for Black Pulse bidding you good night and encouraging you to watch us next week.